Good afternoon. It's quarter to three. And uh, we've been out here for a lot of the day. Not all of the day, by all means. But some of the day. There's actually a, a dark cloud floating over here right now. It's kind of weird because it's been really sunny all day. Stephanie and I have uh, shifted our meeting from Monday to Wednesday because the weather forecast is better. So, okay. I have been out and about today. I went out because I ordered um, a couple of bags of kitty litter from PetSmart. So they finally uh, called me or emailed me to say that uh, my order had been picked. So I went there and got that. Ran into the principal of the school. Paul Cox, the guy who runs the place. I wouldn't have known him because he was wearing a mask. And he says, oh, hi, Monica. And I was not wearing a mask at that point. I was just getting out of my car and opening the door and getting ready for the people, bringing up my order. So he saw me and we chatted for a minute. He says, oh, I didn't know you were a Cambridgeite. Yep. Me too. I told him where I lived. I know I know where he lives, which I guess Stephanie already knew that. He lives up near St. Benny's. And uh, yeah, that was it. Then from there, I went on to Home Depot to get some more stain because we we're sort of running low on stain and there's still some finishing underneath that needs to be done and if you don't have quite enough you're being unnecessarily stingy so I got a, a quart rather than a gallon I can't believe that it's still in those measures but I guess it's from the states or wherever I'm just itchy sticky and itchy yeah, so I, I uh, got that, and I thought about stopping off somewhere else on the way home, and I thought, no, I'll just go home. And nobody's home. Gina's still away, so that's kind of nice and peaceful. And then I got, I checked my mail again. Can you tell I'm compulsive about that? My school mail. Lucky that I did. Because one of my oldest, in terms of age students, had sent an email saying he wanted to uh, uh, he wanted to come in the uh, in the fall. So I added him on the list. Added him onto the list. Raphael. A real personality, a real uh, neat guy. Just a nice guy that you want in your class, you know? Brings you a coffee every Friday. That's the guy. And now that I'm drinking my coffee black, it'll be fine. So I came home and I'm back to reading. My my iPad ran out, so I'm back to reading. Waking up to what you do. Those little red spider things are everywhere. I saw that this is actually online as well. 
but I think I will keep it just in paper because that limits where I can read it. I have to be in the perfect place to read it. A lot of light. It's a good book. It uh, really just little pains. Um, it's it makes me think. Well, you know, it makes me wake up. It helps me remember. that if I want to live with myself, that I want to be this way, if I want to like myself, that I want to be this way. I don't have to be this way, I'm not forced to be this way, but I like being this way. Really? Come on. It's the, the humid weather pricklies. It's probably me sweating. See, I don't like sweating. It's probably my skin going, yeah, you're sweating. You gotta sweat this weather, you gotta sweat. Anyway, yeah, so Stephanie and I chatted back and forth. She's sitting on her balcony. I'm sitting here, we sent each other pictures, and we changed, because she still worked today. She had to finish off this morning. She had a Saturday morning class. She works all hours she can get. She needs the money. to do that, take all the jobs I could stuff in, fit into my work schedule. I used to take every single one. Mm. Not anymore. I used to work Saturday mornings. I used to work evenings during the week. Yeah, I did. She's working more than I ever did, though, I think. Anyway. That dark cloud is sort of floating over. It's weird how some clouds are dark and some clouds are light. Sometimes you're prickly. You get the hot pricklies. Excuse me. Yeah, so I saw my principal. Didn't see anybody else. So I was at PetSmart, then I went to Home Depot, got my stain, and came home. and reading. And am I waking up to what I do? I don't know. I think of it when I interact with people.